Hello everybody and welcome once again to Galactic Titans 2. So this episode we're going to go to Elpis. So let's go over there. And this time what I've got with me is I've got the jetpack. So what I want to do first of all, I've got some milk as well, but we've got to be fairly quick in this place. Let's just check the time of day, it's fine. Good, we get the milk out of here. We want the quarry, we can leave that till later on. I actually haven't got a quarry with me, that's not clever. But we can doesn't matter. What we need to do is put down the markers. And you do that as fast as possible. And that's what I want the jetpack for for. So I need to I'll put that like that, like that. Okay. So I what I tried to do here was to to reduce the, the, the nausea effect. Let's actually get that out as well, some milk. Because we get done. So let's go out here quickly and stand up somewhere and create our first quarry. I really could do with a bit of speed on this, couldn't I? Let's go up high. See, we're already suffering a bit now from this. So let's put down that, say, here. And in front of it, let's put this down. And let's go and fly. Oh, do I have to press F to fly? No. Nope. I'm not sure how to use the jetpack, to be honest with you. <laughs> Having activated it, I can't remember how to use it. Well, what we have got, though, is some milk. I probably should have brought some food with me. Maybe it's you get worse poisoned if you're actually standing in the one place. I'm not 100% sure. It's probably a control for the jetpack, to be honest with you. So if you can check what it is, I could look it up, but maybe now's not the time. So the whole purpose of this is to put down is the markers. Actually, it's not going to be too bad this time. Look at that. So we need a bit of rock. Let's take a bit of rock. Well, that would be really the problem. The problem, anyway. So look, rock. Ah, uh, rock. Nope. Here's the place I need it. Let's put this marker down. Let's go and have a look at the controls. Let's drink some milk first of all. Get the next bucket out of there. So that should actually prevent nausea for a bit. I hope. Um. Nope, doesn't make any difference, does it? So have a look, let's get moving as fast as we can. Get to the next marker. Hopefully we've got time to do this. As long as we get the markers down, it's not such a big problem to bring the quarry and get the quarry going. He's thinking about this actually quite hard because I've got another milk here. Let's get this milk drunk. So it didn't actually make much difference with it. But what we can do, of course, is quickly go back and I've got some. I think I've got some baked potatoes in the box. I should also look at the controls while I'm in back at base. Let's do that. Replenishing food is no problem whatsoever. And regen is also no problem because I've got here some penicillin at the back here. I've got some baked potatoes here, that's probably good. Let's just move that into there in case that also doesn't help very much. And while we're doing that, let's have a look at now at the get regen 4 on this one. Just a second. Sorry about that. Distraction. They go rush. I've got. I haven't bothered to check the controls for this jetpack, but I have got some potatoes on me, so that's good. Now, where's that line go over there? Good. Difficult to see because it's above our head at the moment, but we should be able to see it when we get up here. So the nausea seems to get worse as you the longer you're here. So that's why we've got to be really quick. A bit of luck. Five minutes is enough. Actually, there is the line over here. Must be. Oh, this I can just see it now against that background over there. This looks like it might be the end. So eat while we're running along here. So difficult to see this as well. 
you got uh, set to three by three. Okay, a bit further. <laughs> Maybe I can use the sky as a, as a guide like that. And there it is, look. So a little bit further forward. Oh, God, it's really hard to see. I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll put some blocks up and go up as fast as we can. Oops, try again. Ha! Why can't I put this block down on this one? Yes, I can. Right, there's the line. Oh, can okay, we can come across here? Hopefully I've got enough blocks. It looks like I'm about the right height. If not, it's going to be a pain. I've got one more and it's not enough. Okay, well that's going to give me a guide as to where it is. Let's just jump down here. Shouldn't be a problem with that stuff. Let's just change it to 5x5. Five five. Oh, still 3x3. Three three. That'll be fine. So where are we there? Okay, 15 blocks. Let's eat another potato. Let's see if we can get up here. There's the line. It's really very bad to see on this one, isn't it? I think it might be related to the amount of blocks that are in your area. Okay, I'm one block too high. Never mind, let's just jump down there and just start putting the blocks down here. Oh, I should do it this way, can't Nope, I've got to go up. And I've run out of blocks. Brilliant. Let's eat another potato. Get that regen going. Get some more blocks. I don't know if I can jump up two blocks. I can just. See, I'm being very fast and trying to be fast anyway. That's probably not going to work, will we? Oh, that's a big jump. Great, now I've got the marker on the place. That's all we need to do. Let's get back as fast as we can. I'm not sure what time of day it is either. We can... This is actually not too bad, really. Actually, we can eat and move at the same time. Shame milk didn't work. After going to all that trouble to make a farm. But it does seem that the best thing to do is move as fast as you can. So we simply right click this. And that should be done. We can remove that that torch. Oh, what's happened here? I need to go back. I seem to have misplaced the block. That's really bad. Let's go back into base and... Actually, I can't find the base. Where has it gone to? Oh, that's strange. Well, I suppose I don't really have time to do that now, do I? Well, I suppose we could do it. Let's have a look at the clock. Oh, it's just after midday. We've got the we've got the waste stone within its charged up, so we can always go back home. That's no big deal. So let's get going again. So what's gone wrong here? It's, it's fine in that direction, but not fine in this direction. All right, we're going to have to go this way. I think this is the direction we started off in. It's a bit weird, I haven't done that before. We'll go around as quickest.
Well, I messed that up. Tell you what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to go home. I can't see a solution for this one. So we need to go back to moon base. And then we'll put this ellipse, what have we got here? Surf surface rock away. We don't need that at the moment. It doesn't seem that you've got that in your hand. It actually causes nausea, so that's fine. So it's good having the potatoes as a food source. It's a shame about the milk. We can drink that anyway. Oxygen. Let's just check with the oxygen supplies. I didn't really look at that. Oh, plenty. So what we also need to do, of course, is to make a quarry. Do you know, I thought I, would, I think how I, of course, I didn't know exactly what I did with a quarry. I moved it, didn't I? Let's double check what we need in this thing here now. So we've got an ender chest for that storage. We've got an ender chest there. That's no big deal. But we need a, a plain ender chest and a quarry. Let's go and get that made up. I don't think I've got a recipe for quarry. No. Ender chests we do have. We only need one of those. So let's start that. And the quarry itself, that's actually quite a hard one. So what I think I'll do... I don't need I've done that already on camera so I don't think I need to repeat repeat the, that process but we were also doing this one weren't we the chemical reactor I was also trying to put milk, milk, milk in a bottle and I couldn't get it in because there's no recipe for it so why are we on this one right we've got those and then some machines are in here I moved the machines down here so we need a compressor not a centrifuge, pulverizer, industrial. Oh, we only got the compressor. Okay. If I remember right, that was where it went to. Compressor, magnetizer. Let's get that one done as well. Then we can at least cl clear off a few of these quests. So the magnetizer is what? Oh, some more frames. That's no big deal. So what you can do in here, right, we've got those, redstone. Um, iron casings. Basic machine frame, I'm gonna make sh no, we'll be all right with one, I'm sure. Let's quickly put these and extrude these. You get the two frames, that's great. Fences, I mean. Right, one well, magnetizer, fantastic. Let's put that in there. Now, what was the third thing we need? Oh, the extractor. So, of course, we need some more um, tree taps. Oops. Yeah, I've missed the thing, didn't I? four of those right let's make four of these tree taps now of course they don't stack and it was the basic machine casing wasn't it yep so I think that's all we now need for this Oh yeah, a chemical reactor. Fantastic. So, <clears throat> that's another quest completed by the looks of it. I'm actually curious as to what all these chemical things are used for. So let's look at that. I can't remember which one it is now. Stars line. No, it's take flight. So, one chemical reactor. Let's figure out the rewards one. Okay, the six people one. That's right, done. Claim. Done. So that's basically finishing that until we do this. And I can actually do this. Now, the, this one here basically is 64 rubber. Rubber wood. And 64 rubber wood. Let's have a look at that, that in the case you don't know what it is. 
uh, down here, don't I? This one. We can make 64 with one UU matter. So I would rather keep the UU matter until we've got 64 and then make this. So it's just a question of how much scrap we've got. So let's have a look at how scrap's doing. 138,000. I reckon that's going up reasonably fast. Because we've got two quarries doing that. It's actually not doing too badly. I could actually go and have a look downstairs and see what we could do with it. And we'll put this in here. And that's actually what we could do is this. And I don't know what we need this for either. Have I got quintuple? No, I don't. Let's do that one. Ah. Uh, we can do this one. We get 64. <laughs> right, that's that one done. We should get a stack of this if we actually look at that now. Stack on 16, but I don't know what we need those for. Anyway, it saves a bit of space, I think, because we get some some more items. So I think that'll do for that. Now, the quarry. I think that we might as well get the right ingredients ready for quarry, actually. So the quarry plus is this one. So 32 diamonds, 32 gold, 64. Let's see if I can remember that. Diamonds. We need half a stack of 13,000. It's enormous. Um, gold. I think it was a stack, half a stack. We're going to take a stack just in case. Um, iron. That was a stack of ingots. Redstone, I think 16, but... Um, We've got plenty for a stack, and then ender pearls. We need two. That's a noisy lorry going past. Let's put those into there, and it doesn't really matter if we actually have too much stuff because you actually can do this place place a plus and break a pluses, which we really just want the quarry plus to be made. And when that's finished, it'll go up the top there. I'm not exactly sure what we need those for. I think those are probably equivalent to an annihilation frame and a uh, plane. And the placer will be the other one, which I can't remember the name of it at the moment. Anyway, that will be made so we can get that quarry going. What else do we need to do? Because, right, we can put the chemical reactor away. In fact, what I could do is to take some of these machines and see what they can do. So we could put the chemical reactor down here like this. Right click it and then we should have some recipes in here. So this is a calcium carbonate cell from what? Doesn't tell me, it should tell me here. Carbon cell and whatever this is, which is not very useful. So we can, okay, that makes this is rather which we could do anyway. This one makes nitro carbon cells from, ah, a nitrogen cell and a carbon carbon so I don't know what the uses of these things are to be quite honest with you so that would actually make a carbon yeah, okay, it's just the reverse isn't it the industrial e electrolyzer so there's a load of recipes I'll go through those in my own time hopefully we've got the quarry plus now yeah, you see, it was, it was only 16 or 32 gold, so actually what we didn't... Let's put those back into the system, we don't need those. I'm not going to bother enchanting this for the time being. We can always go back and enchant it later on. Let's go... Let's go to Elpis again. Now the quarry, I put up here, didn't I? Let's quickly make, I'm going to make a marker where this quarry is. 
This morning there shouldn't be too many mobs around. It does sound like there were a lot. Let's put this down here like that. Ah, uh, that's rubbish. What have I just done? Whoops. Actually, that's not too bad. I can sort that out. Let's put that back down there. Because inside it will be the, the chest and the marker. So it was basically the marker was here. Let's just go back and get that. Um, let's just mark the quarry here. Save that. Let's go back to the base, and I should actually mark the base out as well. Get the potatoes out of here as well. I'll just stand in here while I'm doing that. Let's get the potatoes out of here. Oh, I've still got this on me. Fine. I'm sure there's something else I need. Let's take this glycerine with me. Oh, no, I don't need that. I'll take it with me anyway because it doesn't hurt. Oh, this chest is what I wanted, wasn't it? Let's just do it like that for the time being. See, I'm standing in the re regen force, so it's not so bad. So all I need to do is put a chest on top of this quarry here. I don't like this place much, I will be honest with you. <laughs> oh, that's actually not good. Where is the... Um is it because it's got no power? I'll tell you what we'll do. Must be some mobs under the ground though. Let's just mark here as a base as well. So mark up B. So it's green and let's do its base. Save that. We also need a block. I haven't got any, oh, I've got a block with me, of course. Um, let me just quickly go through here, get some food and some regen. Let's take another one of these, just in case I've lost it. We do actually need a, one of the sterling generators, and we will also take the carbon. I didn't bring up the other one, which is fine, but this is just a bit of a problem, but not too serious. I'll have to come and do it, but you know. I don't like this place and I'm definitely making mistakes because I don't like it. <laughs> so I think that was there. So this is where the, the marker should be, I reckon. And let's just put down the torch, which I didn't get. So I know what to do. Let's just put a let's put the, the sterling generator down here. It should have some power in it. Where's the sterling generator? No way I forgot the sterling I thought I took that out of there. As I say, you make mistakes when you're not really working. Oh, I did, look. I didn't take it out. Oh. Quickly get the regen and let's go back again. So what I'm going to do is just stick the sterling generator beside this. And that'll give it a bit of power. And it should then be able to... Oops, what am I doing? put that down like that and that should then no nope, it didn't where in the earth has it gone to okay let's just remove the silly so generator because I don't want it to do that and then let's just remove that okay let's put the torch down and I haven't got the torch either ah oh. where's my redstone torch why am I doing badly move that one out of the way. I thought I had a redstone touch. I don't know what's happened to those. Because they got picked up and they disappeared. So this decays over time. It's weird, isn't it? So let's put the redstone touch down here like that. And then we should be able to right click this anyway. Oh, see, that is actually lined up. So this was the, must have been the way I went before. Let's get this going. Should keep an eye on the clock as well. Let's have a look. Oh, it's only midday. That's fine. Let's 
Well, there's a full part of damage sometimes from those things. It's a, it's a bit tough. Because this is the one I put up that was a, probably quite a long, quite high up, wasn't it? See the line? Yeah, it's here. Well, that's woo. That's a big jump. What happened then? Okay. Oh, then maybe I was in flight mode. Because I still got the jetpack on. Do you know this is very strange? I'm sure I put these down. So maybe something went on and it lost the the bit. That's very strange. I don't understand that at all. Let's eat a bit. Keep our health going. Here. Whoa! Goodness gracious me, I would have died if I had not got the... Uh... Do you not think it's a jetpack? Oh, it's one too high. Okay, no problem. Right, that should be it. Let's get back home quick as we can. Get this quarry sort of on its way. Doing some funny things on the road over there. Oh, come a bad way, really. That's interesting. Probably flame out oil, which does look quite uh, like some mobs. Is that? Ooh. I don't. I jump up. But I don't fly anywhere. That's a double space. Which to go with this? Oh, what's happened here? Don't like this. This is very strange. <laughs> uh oh! I need to eat. I wonder if I can get out of here. I'll tell you what, we're going to have to do. We're going to have to go back home. Well, there we are then. That's actually quite tricky. And I didn't expect that to happen, otherwise I'd have waited for the, re um, the rendering to finish. So, I'm going to have to figure out my jetpack. I'm going to have to come and fix this quarry, and next time we'll do, do that. And see if we can complete this Yu Yu Mata quest. So until then, bye for now.